cheek on the chin and on the forehead three two Okay. And it cannot be metaphysical words, right? It cannot be like attracting. <laughs> it cannot be like manifesting. Yeah, it cannot okay. be manifesting. Real you have, things. You have, okay. to, you have to, it's called actionable okay. things, right? Like, actionable things. Not the number that you can call. Okay. Or find the person who you, you're about to call. Okay. Or, I don't think it's music festival that you go to. Oh, yeah, I didn't want like or that. things yeah. like that. Um, just write that down and have this action plan. Okay. Or action things that you can do. And if you do the 10 things, more action is going to come from that, right? That makes sense. So, but the, what I'm seeing here is, it's great that you're going to manifest a lot of things. It's great that you're attracting a lot of things. But is there's not, there's not a lot of things that you can really hold on to. Yeah, I'd like it to be a little bit more tangible. Right, it's kind of like a song that is all feeling words, right? You, know, yeah. you kind of need a few words that are like, you know, objects. Yeah. That you can see, right? Mm -hmm. So that, that maybe, that would help you. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Um, so very quickly, if you want to change one thing about you, and you have to articulate that very clearly um, to help you um, feel more free financially, is that? Yeah. Yeah. I think I would like to overcome the block that having money is bad. What does that block look like? It feels like, look like. I look. If you can picture this block, what would it look like? I don't know how to picture a block. What do you mean by that? Well, right now, you're talking about all about feelings, right? Okay. And if you could have feel the way around this, you would have already done that. Right. So let's change the, the sensation or strategy. So okay. feeling it, I'm what does it look it. like? It looks like a wall. Okay. That more of an object. Um, what color is the wall? Red. How big is the wall? It's a brick wall, probably about five feet tall. Okay. Do you see any writings on the wall? No. Okay. Um, does the wall make any sound? No. Is it talking to you? No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. So, what are we about to do now is hypnosis. Okay. Uh, it's perfectly safe. Okay. Last time I checked. <laughs> so far, so good. <laughs> um, so, hypnosis is not sleep. At no point, you're going to feel like you're out of this world. Okay. You're not going to be unconscious in any way. You'll still be aware of what's happening around you. It will just be like the time you're just about to fall asleep. Okay. Um, and it's a lot like falling asleep. Um, the harder you try to fall asleep, the harder it is to go to sleep, right? Mm -hmm. So don't try to go into hypnosis. Just follow the sound of my voice and I just have drift. Okay. All right. Okay. So sit back with your feet right on the floor. Okay. And just focus on the center of my palm. I'm going to, I'm going to count backwards from three to one. When I reach number one, I would like you to just close your eyes. As soon as you close your eyes, I want you to imagine yourself on a calm, quiet beach. You can feel the warm rays of the sun on the tip of your nose. You can feel the warm rays of the sun on your cheek, on your chin, and on your forehead. Three, two,
feel this warmth from the lower part of the body. You can feel the warm sand underneath the toes. You can feel the feet of the toes sticking into the warm sand. You can feel your back. Feel yourself sinking deeper and deeper in your softness of this cushion. As I count backwards from flat to one, when I reach the number one, you can just allow this time to sink all the way down into the softness of this cushion, all the way down into your deep. be a place that you've been before, never been before, a room or an afternoon. And it is a place that brings you both joy, delight, good light, and joy. I would like you to just step into this beautiful scene. And as your conscious mind is occupied by this beautiful thought, your conscious mind is wide open, ready to receive all the Just use your conscious mind to find all the negative energy that you're holding on to your finances. It could be energies from the past, or it could be energy from the recent past. It could be a big event, a small event. It may even be things that you never realized that had a hold on you. But use your conscious mind to find Just feel that and hide the walls throughout your body and throughout your mind. And it's not necessary all inside your head. You may find tiny bits of virgin. You may find tiny bits of negative thoughts, tiny bits of negative energy on your cheek, on your eyes. Could be on your elbow or fingers or your feet. Just find them and let them go. Let let them dissipate and let them go. That's right. And in this unconscious mind, you can see a wall in front of you, a big red wall that is about five feet high, like you have described to me. And just see yourself walking through this fog. Picture yourself going through this, and it's not stopping you. Just feel yourself and hear yourself going through this fog right now. And behind this wall, you see all the great things that you can accomplish. You see all the wealth and all the things that you can do with the financial freedom that you get with 
all the talents that you have, that you're entitled to. On this other side of the wall, as you go vertical, you can see light, you can hear sounds, you can see images. It may or may not make sense to you right now. But you can see yourself on the other side. Just let all the past negativity dissipate in the universe right now. From now <coughs> on, you're going to feel confident. From now on, you're going to feel self assured. From now on, you will have the energy to face all your financial responsibility with great competency, with great confidence. You have an action plan all the things that you can do to help you make money in a very positive way at the same time to help people. And you can use your unconscious mind to feel connected to all the finances and all the wealth and all the great things that you can accomplish and all the people that you can help with gaining financial freedom. That's right. And just feel your mind develop on this great white light that is free from all negative emotions and all negative energy. This white light that brings you financial freedom, overcoming all problems, connecting to the real you, the you that is talented, the you that is confident, the you that is very capable. the number 10, you come back to this room, feeling great, feeling like you've just left the last half hour, totally refreshed, no big smile on your face, confident in your ability and your talents, in your ability to confront your financial responsibility, and confidence in being financially independent. One, two, Whenever you're ready, you can open your eyes. Feels good, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. I feel thank very relaxed. <laughs> oh, thank you. Join us next week, Tuesday night, 7.30, CCTV, Channel 9.